there folks, this is Josh Stony Ridge Farmer. Welcome back to another beautiful day here in the foothills of the Blue Ridge Mountains in North Carolina. And we've got Skitty Bop out, and Skitty Bop is dressed in its finest attire today. This is called the Dan User Intimidator, and it is a combination tree cutter, tree puller, fence post puller, and stump bucket and grapple all in one. It's like an all-in-one combination platter for the farm, basically. We're up here on a neighbor's piece of property and we're helping him out. He's clearing some new pasture so he can fence in some cows and some horses. And we're gonna have some fun ripping trees out of the ground today and digging up stumps. So come along as we put the Dan User Intimidator to work. I'll show you what it is and we'll talk all about it and we'll get busy, all right? Woo! <laughs> I'm always excited to show you a fun new tool here on the farm and this is no exception at all so the folks at Dan user reached out to me on this and we ended up picking up one of these intimidators for a great deal and what we're gonna be doing here today is clearing out these areas right back here we'll kind of walk you through so we've got some fairly dense vegetation in here these are just uh, growth basically that's too big to cut with a brush hog or you could use probably a brush cutter or a forestry mulcher but my neighbor really doesn't want to fork out the dough that it costs to have a forestry mulcher up here so i saw what he was doing and i reached out to him and said look man why don't you just let me come up there and you can just pay for my fuel and i'll get busy and take out some of this stuff for you he said cool so what we have here is a, a uh, post puller slash tree puller and you can see it has teeth on it it has almost saw blade teeth right here on either side so this is designed and you also see teeth here on the front so you clamp this thing together and you'll see this in the footage and it turns into a stump bucket where you can dig out a stump and we just dug out a little maple stump up here i've been testing it out it also has the saw blade so you can go right up to the edge of a tree and go back and forth back and forth back and forth at the bottom at ground level and chop it off in case it's too big for this thing to handle now you also have the grabber right here the grapple bucket and you can drive up to one tree pluck it next tree pluck it pluck it pluck it just keep plucking trees and then we're going to take them all over here to a big burn pile so here's what it looks like after we pulled a stump and this was a little poplar tree you've got a little hole right there and we just flicked out a maple stump which is right down the road right here but we've got a ton a ton of work to do man so this entire area right here is what we're trying to do we're trying to clean all this up for the neighbor get it done have some fun get outside get some fresh air and rip some trees out of the ground all right <laughs>
All right, guys, it never fails. If something goes wrong, always. I've got a little bit of a hydraulic leak, so I had to zip back to the house, and I'm only like maybe a mile from my house, and this is what we're using. So I use High Guard in this machine, and this is an awesome pump that goes in a five-gallon bucket. So when you're filling up something like this that has hydraulics, all you gotta do is squeeze the trigger on this hose, and it'll fill it up really really easy it's a rechargeable battery system and it saves you so much time and frustration picking up a five gallon bucket so when we do our oil we use five gallon buckets we buy it in bulk so that we save a little bit of money that's what that is McNaught I'll post the link down in the video description for you so we're faced with a unique opportunity because I was almost out of hydraulic fluid in this in this bucket right here so we're presented with a pretty cool unique opportunity we're going to take off the McNaught pump and put it on a new bucket so the way it comes off it just screws off very simple and there's a pickup tube down in there okay this pickup tube is uh, adjustable so you can get it at the very bottom of the bucket and right here I'll show you on the on the spout of the bucket there's an adapter so all you do is take the lid off the bucket very simple let me angle the camera down for you take the lid off the bucket pull the tab to open it put the adapter on just like so if it'll go on there today there we go put the adapter on snug it down slide our spout down in here very simple and then screw it in place hit the power button it starts picking up and it shuts off when it's reached the amount of pressure that it needs to reach pretty cool That was a stump, man. <laughs> Holy cow, man.
results. We stacked up a big old pile. That's Scott, look, running, running. <laughs> running from the uh, camera. So Scott is Big Rock, Big Rock, let's talk about your dogs, man. Big, Big Rock K9. Big Rock K9. So that's where we got Buddy and Lexi from. These guys are the dog breeders that we got Buddy and Lexi. They've got some awesome, like champion bred, yeah. best in the world German Shepherds, right? Absolutely. He's shy, Top man. Of the line. Best, best world champion lines. Nice. Working lines. Awesome. Yeah. Well, are you happy? Are you happy Absolutely. with what we got yeah, here? It's great. Man, it's great. I made a big mess. Got a lot done. <laughs> got a lot done. It's really good. That yeah. thing really works good. I think so too, man. Look at this pile. What an awesome pile, man. We we kicked some butt here. I've got a little hydraulic problem, so look for a video in the future with me fixing Skitty Bop's hydraulics. I don't know what's going on. It's a little jumpy. I don't know. I don't know, man. I, you think about what you're buying, and, and I bought a used piece of machinery. Did I buy somebody else's problem? Ugh, I don't know. I'll post a link down here to the Intimidator for you. Again, this is a Dan User Intimidator made in the USA, right in Missouri. We've been, I've been to the factory. When I went out and visited Greg Judy, I stopped by the Dan User factory and talked to those guys. So thanks again to Dan User for giving me a great deal on the machine, and super duper happy with it. Hopefully we can make a little bit of side money with that. All right. Thanks, guys. We'll see you next time on the Stony Ridge. Woo! Wait. Woo! Woo! <laughs> All right. It did good. <laughs> see y'all later. Well, come on down to the Stony Ridge. Bring your wife and bring your kids. We're living life pure and sweet. That's the way it's supposed to be, Stony Ridge. Woo! What else? What am I missing? Tree puller, fence post puller, every. <laughs> I wish everybody mowed their yards. This should be the final take. Saw slash fence post of uh, <laughs> fence post everybody. Woo 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 Ooh, yeah. <laughs> This is the Dan User Intimidator. It is a combination tree puller slash post tree tree blip. <laughs> More lawnmowers, please. <laughs> you skid gear. Skid gear. Thanks, guys. See you man.